Hello everyone, this is me, Sabda here, and I'm back with the third week of March reads, shot from the 15th through the 21st of March 2024. This reading is going to be for the sign of Sagittarius. So Sagittarius, let's see what's coming in for you for this week time. I will be adding a lot many cards here in this reading, so stay tuned. And before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it's a general reading. It may not resonate with everyone out there. Pick whatever resonates and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's see what's coming in for Sagittarius. Let's begin. Seven of Swords, Temperance, Two of Wands, The Star, Four of Wands, Page of Wands. I read the deck. We do have Nine of Pentacles. Wow, Sagittarius, I really feel like, you know, um, I really see some sort of movement coming up for you in your love life. I feel like, you know, if you have been running away from commitment, marriage, engagement, you are going to feel like, no, you are ready for it now. Um, whether it was because of your work or whether it was because of, uh, you know, your breakups, whether it was because of the past experiences, you have felt that maybe you were not ready, you were not healed, you were not prepared. But I really feel like, you know, this week is the time when you're going to feel like, no, now you're ready. Now you're setting some intentions and goals when it comes to your love life. And you're very happy and uh, very excited about it. Um, you are going to be more focused on yourself, your happiness, your well-being. And I feel like, you know, you are going to feel very, very excited to move on forward in your life um setting some new goals new intentions i feel like you know for some of you um you are going to feel that urge to to move forward as well uh whether it was a work life scenario or a love life scenario i feel like you know you're going to feel that you know you need to keep your life happy excited fulfilling so anything and everything that is aligning you with that you are going to take that action and everything that is kind of like you know keeping you away from having that abundance in your life, you're gonna push that thing out of your life. So I really see that movement coming up for you in your life where you are gonna be attracting a lot of attention your way. You are gonna be attracting a lot of uh, positivity your way because you are choosing positivity yourself as well. So I really see that you are ready for a new beginning. You are ready for a new chapter. You are ready to put the past behind and move forward with positivity around your life. Um, I really feel like, you know, as you're going to do that, somebody from the past might return back to you. Uh, but if they do, they will be returning back for something solid and stable. But I really feel like you know, when we talk about this past situation, it is not somebody or someone from the recent past. Uh, it is going to be somebody from the far-fetched past. So I feel like, you know, if you recently broke up with someone, it's not going to be that person. It's going to be somebody from the far-fetched past who might return back to you in your life with a solid proposal to offer. Now, for some of you, maybe you have been resisting that movement ahead in your love life, which has been the reason why your life was stuck in stagnant. But as you put the guards down and you're ready to embrace the newness or the new phase of your life, you are going to attract the right person in your life who is going to be like, exactly how you want your person to be so i really see you moving forward accepting someone coming towards you and moving forward with that i really see that intention is going to be set during this week time i really see this person coming towards you probably in the next week time i really don't see it happening this week but i really see you choosing to accept and embrace that yes you are ready for uh something's committed uh, something beautiful something fulfilling you know your standards you know your god's um, are you know definitely high for wrong people wrong situation past people past situations you really want anything solid and stable and that's exactly what i see coming for you i really feel like you know this week is the time where you are gonna uh prepare yourself up for something abundant to come through in the next week i really see that you know i really see this person approaching you around the next week time but this week is the time when you are setting yourself free from any attachment that you might have had with a specific someone and you were holding on to that specific situation or person or relationship because um, you have now realized that it wasn't worth your time so i really see you moving on moving forward forward during this week time let's see what else is coming in for you i feel like you know for some of you if the energies have been reversed um 
I really feel like, you know, for some of you, maybe you have been dealing with someone who was running away from commitment. And if that's the case, this person is going to be reaching out to you. This person is going to be ready and prepared to give you commitment. And uh, they are going to be like, you know, healed from the past and they would be ready to give you what you want in your relationship as well. So expect that to come through. Maybe somebody is going to be reaching out to you who was, again, I feel like, you know, if it's somebody from the past, it's somebody from the far fresh past. It's not from the recent past. Things have changed for them. They have changed now. They are ready for commitment. And that's how they're going to come through for you. So if it's somebody coming towards you that it is going to happen during this week time if it's you taking action towards someone i really see that you will be meeting this person in the next week time let's see more cards here what else is happening for you during this week time you are worthy your worth doesn't depend on the other person. I really feel like you know, for a majority of you, um, you have now realized that. I feel like you know that's where I really see you attracting a lot of attention because now you know that you're worthy of love, respect, and all the good things that you truly desire to receive in love. And that's exactly what I see coming for you. Um, and the divine really wants you to know that, you know, if somebody didn't value you or didn't love you or didn't commit to you, it was not uh your fault it was not the case that they they believed that you were not worthy of it or you believe that you were not worthy of it it's because they they were not worthy of you basically so they chose not to choose you because they don't deserve you um bonding as you get to know each other you you discover many things in common i really feel like you know there is somebody coming in your love life for sure. And your bonding is going to get strengthened with passing time with this person. I feel, I feel like, you know, for some of you, um, in fact, I feel like, you know, for a majority of you, this person is going to come through around this next week time or towards the end of the month time. I really don't see this person coming towards you this week time. It's, it's a week where you are going to sit yourself free from the bus, um, you know, blockages that you might have imposed on yourself. And that's how you will see this uh person reaching and approaching with an intention to get married or something committed to you. Um, so I really feel like you know, your bond with this person is going to strengthen up with passing days and um, you will have a lot in common. You will have a lot to, um, you know, gel along with. So we do have a fiery climax approach. For some of you, could be dealing with another fire sign or an earth sign. Uh, a fire climax approaches and prosper prosperity lies ahead. I really feel like, you know, when you choose to move on, move forward, open yourself up to love, abundance, happiness, you are definitely going to receive a lot of love and abundance and happiness coming your way. Um, so, yeah, I really feel like, you know, the divine really wants you to believe that something beautiful is going to happen and open yourself up to that. Know that you're worthy of it. Affirm that you are ready for, for miracles to uh, come through you're ready for blessings and we are when you are affirming all of that um it happens quicker so make sure that you're not stuck in anything from the past and move forward move on and that's where you're going to find the one that you are going to get value from that is going to love you respect you for who you are so yeah that's uh, pretty much it coming up for you for this uh, week time if it was of help do like share and subscribe till i do the next read for you guys take care and bye